<laughs> what did you just say to the president? So uh, President Trump had pork producers in the Oval Office more than any other president. He was very supportive of of farmers uh, that, that produce the food that we need in America. It's a crucial time right now in America. This country is uh, facing the food shortage and China coming over. You've been a big supporter of the farmers here in Iowa. I've always been, and we have the cap, so we uh, say make the farmers great again. We actually change our little freight, make the farmers great, and I've been for ethanol where others haven't. And uh, we're with, it and we're the, with you guys with the pork because I like it. We, 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 we all sh- like it. We like the job you do, too. You're great. Thank, Thank you, man. Thank you. So this is the biggest crowd they've ever had, and I'm honored by it. I heard they set a record, which was announced actually a long time ago, and I'm very honored by it. And they say there's one reason for it. And uh, you know what the real reason is? They want to see our country be great again. It's not for me. It's for they want to see our country be great again because this country is going down the tubes. It's going to hell, and we don't want to, we're not going to stand for it, right? Yes, sir. Huh? That's right. Thank you. Where is the pool camera? I think it's great. I think it's uh, a real honor to be here. All right, let me just move this gentleman a little bit. It's a real honor to be here. We have a record that was set. The record is the largest crowd they've ever had, and I can see that because you can't get any more people here. But I just, uh, I'm very honored by it. It's a tremendous thing to watch this and to see this. Now, we do have a beautiful day. It's a beautiful day in Iowa, but there's a record crowd. They've never had anything even close, so I'm very happy by it. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Thank you very much. Thank you. you know what? They should, they should really try and get this country back together. What they've done to this country by weaponization, by the things that they're doing that are so illegal and so wrong, they should try and get our country back together. They are destroying our country. And the media, unfortunately, 